What's up guys, today we will be going for the absolute maximum amount of future pass points you can possibly achieve in one day. So yes, I will be pulling out all the stops, I will be going through every single game mode, and multiple times in this case, um, and trying to get as many uh, future pass levels as I can in just one day. So, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to play um, before the reset, so I can get um, about... 200 points from timeline battle so basically what i'm going to do is i'm going to be doing this challenge on the daily reset day so from timeline battle i can get 400 points because it's i can get 20 and 20 runs in today and then i'm going to um the most difficult part of this is i'm going to be maxing out um the shadowland twice in one day and i'm and i've already stacked this account with um almost 6,000 energy so i'm going to be burning through all that and sure, you can uh, do this way quicker and just buy all the, uh, you can use crystals pretty much and just level this up uh, however much you want. I could just get six levels right there, but I don't want to do that. I want to show this, show you how to do this completely free to play. And yeah, so let's start with um, acquiring some points for free. So that just, that gave us 50 points. All right, so to put this in perspective, 50 whole points count for 18 percent of one level so yeah this is going to be pretty challenging but i think we can get i mean if i got 10 levels in one day that'd be crazy so that's like the absolute max goal but first let's push through shadowland and see how far we can go here this is definitely going to be the most difficult part of this challenge um and i'm gonna have to yeah, this is going to be a struggle, guys. So, yeah. Let's see how Kingo can do. Just a little four-star Kingo. Um, yeah, he does not have... Ooh, he doesn't have that much HP for this. Yeah, he can't do it. I don't care. This should be enough right here. We should get our first Shadowland clear, which I believe Shadowland each clear gives you 15 uh, points. So, yeah. Okay, let's not screw this up. good here i think we win this all right there we go that gave us oh that that only gave, that gave us 10 okay 10 i mean it's not bad we should i'm hoping to get at least like 50 shadowland clears here but anyways we got a rumble stage the rumble stages are usually better for free to play accounts because you can just like throw in a bunch of like mid tunes and they'll all you know work together and beat the stage i guess so yeah Let's try. I'm just gonna upgrade this dude's mastery a little bit to get a little bit of a better leadership. There we go. Alright, so Aries and Dakin, it's a pretty solid team right there. We don't want to go too overkill because you know how Shadowland works. We want to save, um, save the better tunes for the uh, later stages. But let's see. I think Ares should do quite a bit of work here for me. And yeah. All right, this is good. Yes, Ares is actually a bit overkill for this. He's just, just demolishing the stage, but 
Wow, what the hell? Okay, Nick. Okay. Um, yeah, alright. Um, well, then how the freak am I. Bro! How do they reflect enemy energy damage and physical damage? <laughs> what? Alright, well. I can't do it. The devs are just being weird. I don't know. That this stage has never been like that. I that's like before it was like Oh my gosh. Yeah, I don't know. I guess the uh I guess these speed types can just reflect every type of damage now. Okay. Scourge is actually kinda strong. Scourge's skills are very similar to Ares's in terms of their look. So yeah, I mean this they just randomly activate like right there out of nowhere dude out of nowhere they just activate physical damage reflection like gosh dang all right now i have to run i have to run i have to run uh, they're gonna gonna let them fight and i'm just gonna run there we go all right there we go I, I don't know maybe i was doing like way too much damage so it just shut me down the, yeah that's that was weird dude all right let's try this universal type stage by the way this is also the first time I've, i'm even pushing shadow land on the free to play account i've really never done this before i can just use like gore here knowledge overpower the stage which that's not a bad idea. <laughs> Screw it, I'm just gonna... Because, I mean, these tier 3, native tier 3s, they just shut down these low Shadowland stages, even though they're only 1 star level 40. Like, Knowledgeist, yeah. Which is fine, I mean, you could say this is overkill, but I want to be somewhat, you know, timely with this video, and I want to, you know, I don't want this to be that brutal, where I'm trying to get like the perfect perfect character for each stage so that's fine we'll just do that um ooh, villains have an advantage i could go gore just mop the floor with everyone um which is what i'm gonna do by the way we're just gonna do we're just gonna be kind of quick with it gore could go higher than this obviously but Again, I'm trying to be pretty timely with this. This is actually kind of challenging for Gore, even. He's not, like, one-shotting it or anything. Okay. record is for most future pass points acquired in a day without you know spending crystals and without buying the uh, bonus pass because when you buy the bonus pass you get um an upgraded you get an upgraded amount of future pass points that you can get Okay, another rumble stage. A lot, a lot of these characters are gonna be way too strong for this. Like, these guys are, I can use them later. I think Nightcrawler might be good for this and uh, I don't know, War Machine, I mean, War Machine's base kit is horrible, but Scarlet Witch should pretty much carry this. She's a native tier 2. Yeah, 
Yeah, way too easy, dude. Alright, let's see what combats we have. Lizard's actually pretty strong. So let's see. Nice, we got a free revive. Cannot do this, that sucks. I'm just gonna cut it here and then come back to me. Okay, let's unlock King now for this next stage. Okay, so we're pretty far into Shadowland right now. We got about an hour before it all resets. But one thing I want to show you guys is the one thing you got to do to get future pass points is world event. All you have to do is click ready and you get 50 free future pass points right there. You don't have to play it. You don't do anything. You just get 50 free future pass points. All right, now I'm going to be back to Shadowland, and we'll be back when I'm done with okay, the Okay, guys, so we got one more clear of Shadowland left, and then we're going to see the results so far. So we got to stage 60 here. Um, stage 60, I mean, it's not bad. Uh, it's not, like, amazing, obviously. Probably could have gone a bit higher. But yeah, 
Um, obviously, I have characters that are way too strong for these stages now, so um, pretty much just auto playing it. And yeah, um, I, I, won't, I really want to see the results, but um, the only bad news this means is after the weekly reset, which happens in about an hour from now, so I have to do 60 more clears. Um, yeah, it's gonna stink, but I want to do it for the video. I want to see uh, how far we can push the future pass on um, free to play. Yeah, so Hulk's actually going quite slow here compared to my other clears, but there we go. So yeah, that's the highest I've gone on the free-to-play account for Shadowland. Oh, and let's see. Dude, I'm gonna be mad if the future passes, like, if it gives me nothing from that. Let's see. Yo, we got three levels from that. That is great. That's way more than I expected, so that means I get another three gist from Shadowland. Okay, so we got a claim all button there. Nice. Um, this is also with the world event, by the way. Not purely Shadowland. And it's also with the um, acquire for free button. So, yeah. Now, all we have to do before the weekly reset is timeline battle and then alliance battle. So, um, let's go. Let's see. We have 53 minutes until weekly reset. So, let's just auto through these. I don't really care if I win or lose, by the way. But yeah, I'm probably going to put this on time-lapse, and yeah, see ya.
Okay, so now we're going to play Alliance Battle. These give 50 future pass points apiece. Okay, so this time around, our second run through of Shadowland today, we are actually managing to get through stage 61 this time. Last time we got to stage 60, today we pushed a little, slightly bit harder and we got through to stage 61. So here's Hulk, I'm just gonna auto play it. Yeah, this Hulk has a 200 proc, so. Nice. And then once we're done with this, I'm gonna see all of the Shadowland rewards we got from clearing Shadowland literally 120 times today. 121 times now. Okay, so that is our final clear there. Let's go over here. And yeah, as you can see, we got an insane amount of rewards from Shadowland. Um, yeah. I wonder if I claimed all the gold. I think I claimed all the gold and stuff. Because... Usually you get millions of gold from Shadowland. Not sure what that's about. But yeah, let's go through these chests. Then once I'm done with this, I'm gonna go through World Event and just ready, click ready for that so it gives me the 50 free Future Pass points. All right, I think we can get CTPs from the Shadowland chest, by the way, which would be a great help, um, especially for this uh, weak free-to-play account. So let's see, all right. Some Uru, an ISO, some hidden tickets, an obelisk, some UUK, another obelisk, ISO. Alright, a lot of ISO, a lot of Uru. Ooh, that, man, those back to back, you know, six star rewards there. So, yeah, we're probably not gonna get a CTP from this. Which usually, I mean, it's are extremely rare, but yeah. All right. Should be about it. Yeah, this is a ton of rewards. I did not expect all this. These daredevil chests. Mm, a few more, okay, cool. All right, so there you have it. We got all these, you know, biometric selectors. Oh my, th we got three of the 150 ones. Yeah, we, yeah. Okay, now I'm gonna go over, I'm gonna hop over to the world event. So watch, I'm gonna click ready. Boom, 50 future pass points for free. All right, so we've officially gotten to six levels so far in one day alone, and we're not even close to being done, guys. That's the crazy part. So now I'm just gonna grind through this, and yeah, just gonna keep grinding. We're gonna get 200 points from Timeline Battle in total, I believe, because each clear is 20 points. And we should auto most teams, because these teams are pure garbage right here. What are we looking at? We got all tier twos. Characters that haven't been meta ever, I don't think. Yeah. It's just a complete shit show here in Silver League. Maybe we can fight some stronger teams to get some entertainment. This team looks decent. We got metas, but they're all tier two and level 70, tier three. I mean, should win. Alright, there we go. He doesn't have his artifact. Ooh, we lost. Yeah. Oh, we won. Wow. Uh, okay. Jean should kill us here. And hopefully Spider-Man can finish her with the one shot. Okay. Now let's... There we go. All right. And as you can see, boom, 20 future pass points right there in the corner. Amazing. And we still got... We still have to clear a lines battle... 
co-op dimension mission. I still have 6,000 energy to use. So yeah, we are nowhere near being done with this. Um, yeah. Okay, but yeah, don't trigger the artifact. Carnage should just, yeah, one shot him. Moon Knight, old uniform. Come on, dude. You don't even bother. Okay, there we go. Probably just gonna end up editing this and spinning it up or cutting it out because this is pretty boring. I mean, these teams suck, dude. This team doesn't suck. No, I'm kidding, it does. We're undefeated. Perfect. Although it doesn't matter for the purpose of this video. I haven't even logged on to this free-to-play account in like two weeks. So there's that. You hate to see a speed type one shot in combat like that. Old King Thanos, let's see this. Yeah, Old King Thanos ain't mad at all. Not even as good as Farmer Thanos, buddy. This is actually the hardest team I've seen so far. to win. Let's see how Gene does this. Ooh, wow, okay. I forget what I said earlier, maybe Hulking Thanos is him.
yo, I can't do it. I can't, I can't beat this guy, bro. Okay, one more match left. I just I want to see what build the Thanos has, cause I don't. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous, dude. Okay. I mean, I guess he's just proccing that and one-shotting, but this guy's cards suck. I think I'm just fighting a joke team now. They just gave me, like, the worst account in the game to fight against. The disrespect is crazy. Wow, what a big surprise. Okay. Yeah, that was another 200. So we just, wow, we went up a lot with that. So yeah, seven right there. And I'm just going to auto through this, and then I'll see you guys after. Now I'm going to move on and do a ton of dimension mission clears. Um, I'm going to be using some boost points for dimension mission. It seems like a waste, but it lets me conserve a small amount of energy. And actually, I just unlocked stage 15 today, I think, so I'm just going to manual play through this, or um, not manual play, but just play this out, and then I can start clearing it. I'm not exactly sure the strategy for Dimension Mission if I want to go super low stages so it conserves less energy, but then I get the rewards, um, those... Uh, Dimension token rewards much less if I do that, but it does cost less energy So I might I'm, I'm just gonna experiment with the maximum level clears first to get those um, dimension tokens and boxes All right, Let's just rush through this Super challenging content there, I know. It's crazy. Um, yeah, one future pass point. Okay. Bonus boost reward. Cool. So, yeah, what I'm going to do... Because, look. Um, so, yeah, I can just get 40 clears right here. So, obviously, it's 10 each time. Whoa, are you kidding? Bruh. I mean, that makes sense, considering I did all of those, um, clears of stuff of Shadowland. I'm actually gonna have to do a lot of cleaning out here. Okay, that should be fine. Boom. Okay, we got 10. So this is gonna be like 400 future pass points. No, no. This is gonna be like only like 40 or so future pass points. But then there's gonna be a lot more with the um, rewards you get from these uh, boxes. So, yeah, 15. Yeah, so that's actually really worth it. We get 15 each time from that, which is actually a lot. I wonder who would require all. Yeah, pl wow, plus 105. Hold on, I have a... Well, we get future pass points for acquiring. I've never paid attention to this, but... Okay, I guess, I guess we have future pass points from that, too. All right, so I'm just going to go 40, 40, 40. And, um... I'm actually interested. Will I keep acquiring future pass points from... Hold on, I just... No. Oh, uh, no. So we do. Yo, okay. This is perfect. I can get a ridiculous amount. Like, just an insane amount here. So... Um, I have to upgrade all of this and sell everything. And then, yeah. I'm gonna grind like crazy. This is 
Yeah, this is ridiculous right here. Just sell these artifacts. Sell all this garbage. We'll even sell five stars. Even sell five stars. We'll even sell five stars of this. We'll even sell five stars of this. Screw it. Okay, there we go. We'll even claim some of these rewards. We'll get energy from this, which is perfect. But yeah. We're just gonna go 40, 40, 40, then claim it probably at least like a thousand future pass points, which is ridiculous, man. The only issue is the inventory thing. But yeah. We still have above 5,000 energy. Wow. Let's just whittle whittle these down as well. And then just go go nuts basically. Go freaking crazy. Alright, buddy, ready? Okay. Okay. Sure. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I don't... We have uh we have kind of a lot of artifacts. We have uh we have some decent amount of story mode fragments I could chunk down but it's fine yeah, this is fine dude so yeah we're going we're going at it right now I'm probably gonna go for like a decent while longer I think this is the best strategy of farming future pass points yeah, this is, yeah, this is great, this is great. I didn't actually expect it to, me to be able to farm this much for the dimension mission. I did not know that those uh, reward boxes you clear, you click on at the end, you know, where you get all your like 2 million gold from dimension mission. I, I did not know that those were just infinite. So yeah, that's wonderful. I'm gonna have to clean my inventory out after this run. Yeah. Buy energy from like challenges, which also give future pass points, so yeah. All right, I'm gonna go one more and then just clear out the inventory again. And there's players with 20k energy, so they could get way more future pass points than what we're getting right now. So yeah. That Spider-Man uniform uh, progress is coming along quite nicely. Can't lie. this won't take too much longer because I really want to see the results um, when I click those boxes what how many um computer cross points it's gonna say I'm gonna get from this so spider-man's um he's actually his uniform is going to be max upgraded like right here 
Yeah. Okay, maybe not. Look, it's so close, dude. Come on. tokens right now we're at what 5,000 dimension tokens so let's see let's see how much that goes up by the time we're done with claiming all these rewards If I click use, I think if I, yeah, I think that actually gets rid of the icons. There we go. So that actually clears some uh, inventory space, which is kind of funny. I can even like just sell these. I mean, the level one tickets are completely useless. getting very low now I'm gonna stop once we get under 120 I'm gonna stop this is like a little excessive I'm gonna try one more hope the inventory is not screwed up okay so we can get I think we just do, what's the math on this? I'm just gonna go, I wanna get to like a good, even like number that's, you know, divisible by five and everything. Let's try one more. Yeah, so watch, I'll just, let's just see. Boom. 300. I thought. Oh, wow. Wow. Look at this. Oh, so it's chunks of 300. Okay. Yo, this is crazy, dude. This is a hack. This is a hack. What the frick? I did not know you can just. Boom. 300. Boom. 300. Boom. Okay, 150. Wow. I, okay, watch this, guys. Pay attention. Oh my gosh. Wow, that blew away my expectations. What the heck? Dude. Yeah, that's crazy, dude. That, that one... Wow. I don't know what to say. Wow. Wow. That's crazy. So yeah, if, I mean, if you need a ton of... Uh, Future pass points, all you have to do is stockpile 5,000, 20,000, 100,000 energy and just get, just get, oh my gosh, I literally just doubled my future pass points with that. That's insane. Whoa. I completed almost, I literally completed one third about of the entire future pass in one day so far and i'm not even done yet we still have world boss okay we still have maybe some giant boss raid 
Um, we still have alliance battle. So yeah, this is crazy. I'm going to cut the recording there and then come back with some world boss. Okay, guys, so I'm going to make one final push to just get the last bit of future pass points I possibly can in one day. Um, so off camera, I did the world boss clears. I had null, did those. I did all these alliance battle clears. So this is what we're at now, but I can still actually um, get points from some little challenges here and there. I believe daily trivia gives you a little bit of... Um, it gives you like five future pass points, something, something light right there. Um, yeah. What? Okay, sure. And then, um, yeah, so you get five a pop from this. So, yeah. Um. Alright, so yeah, that was pretty easy. Can, yeah, we have a bunch of this crap so okay cool and then I'm just gonna free up some more space and then I think I'm not even gonna play boss raid today I'm just gonna straight up use everything on um dimension mission here just because it's so damn overpowered so I'm actually just going to most energy I can from every possible resource so I'm gonna go into the store boom I did the challenges I did all that and then yeah I'm just gonna use the last of the energy on the future pass because we've seen how overpowered this was okay 35 clears here, perfect number. So we should get like, how many do we get from this? 135, not bad. Okay, yeah, and then I could, let's see, if we're close, I think I'm gonna stop there. I think 18 is the record I've seen without buying this or spending crystals to level it up, because look, we can get free levels like that or when you buy on um, this look it gives you bonus future pass points as you can see there with that little uh, green arrow and that triangle so yeah in my opinion that stuff is you know kind of cheating yeah you know but yeah so 18 and a half about um future pass levels in one day if anyone beats that record and has proof, I might give you my free-to-play account because I don't use it anymore. So that's a challenge. If you record proof of yourself getting more than this, in one singular day, you can have the account. Um, and I say that because I don't use this account anymore at all. Um, and it's pretty much dead. Like the last uh, tier 3 I was working on was Wolverine, and it's like, yeah, it's, I mean, it's been brutal. So, yeah, that's an open challenge if anyone wants to do it and has, like, actual proof. Because, I mean, if you have 10,000 energy, you should be able to do this all in one day. Because, I mean, I had five, I had about 6,000 energy, and it just, get, it just, yeah, it force fed me insane rewards. So yeah. Um it's pretty much that. I could like <laughs> I, don't, I need a few more points, but uh let's see what what does this give? Should I go for 19? I, I think I can actually push to get 19 levels. It's uh might be a that might be a stretch actually uh, this giant boss raid gives 25 uh, points when you clear it so this might actually be very beneficial here because it gives 25 future pass points which, which is not bad at all and i feel like if i got to 19 
that's like who's who's beating that dude? I want, I want one person who's beating nineteen in a single day. I want to say this is a world record, but it's not because people buy levels and spend money. But for free to play VIP zeros, I I would like to think this is a world record. Although there are probably players out there who have um, stockpiled t- twenty thousand energy. I've seen it before. Who can get? Who can do that easily? Who can get fifty levels in a day? Because there's players who literally stockpile hundreds of thousands of energy. But yeah. Uh, so yeah, I want to try and push till 19 future pass levels, and that's going to be the record if you can beat that. Um, and with proof, you can have the free-to-play account. And, I mean, I, I did this all on a daily, re- weekly reset day, because obviously you can get you know, double Shadowland clears, double timeline battle entries. All that stuff, double um, alliance battle clears, which is just, you know, it's amazing. So yeah. I'm just gonna end off here. Um, this isn't gonna give me a ton of points, but 25, that's not bad. This guy is using a Thanos, a Farmer Thanos, nice. And that Ghost Rider's not doing too hot. So yeah. Because yeah, this record was brutal, dude. I've been playing. It's literally past midnight. And yeah. There we go. Should show up in the corner there. Yep, 25 points. I didn't use any boost points because I don't really care about farming on this account. Let's see, it probably barely boosted this. Yeah, that, that wasn't... That wasn't nuts, right? That wasn't, you know wasn't anything crazy let's be honest um, hold up can we get some energy here can we cook even farther oh sh- what the heck <laughs> 20 energy okay you know what let's push it to like a slightly a slightly higher percentage. Screw it, dude. We're just gonna go even more insane. There we go. Let's buy 20 energy. Not that. What the? Whoa, they're selling. Whoa, that's crazy. They're selling old icons. That's actually sick, dude. That's a smart idea. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, nice. That's that's interesting, dude. Yeah. So there we go. We can get. Yeah, it's, it's nothing, but. How much boost points for one clear? All right, so we have just enough. For 10 clears here. Oh man. Oh man. So that's gonna be 10, 40, 69%. Okay. Something I wanna, dude. Yeah, that's crazy. Alright, thanks for watching. Subscribe. And yeah, that's that might be the last time we see this free to play account um, on this channel ever again because I really like it's in the gutter right now. So yeah, if you can beat that, so 
That's about it.